Good evening, Facebook family, Tall Pines Baptist Church family. I'm Pastor Chris Woody. It is Sunday evening, March 22nd, 2020. And I just wanted to take a few minutes, share a Bible verse with you this evening, and uh, explain some of what's going on there. I'm thankful to see so many people that uh, worshiped on Facebook with the live streaming this morning, not only at Tall Pines Baptist Church, but at churches all over the land. So we are blessed to have this technology that God has given us in order for the church not to be so much scattered. We might be in different places, but we have to remember that the church is not the building, it is the people. I pray that you're having a blessed evening, that you have a blessed day today. And uh, my prayer is that this uh, virus will be eradicated soon. But if it's God's will for this uh, thing to take its course, just take heed, folks. God is in control. There's nothing we can do about it. We are not called to worry, but we are called to pray. And there's something else that I would like to use to encourage you this evening, and that's the book of Isaiah. And we'll be in chapter 40 and verse 31. And that says, Those who wait upon the Lord will gain new strength. They will mount up with wings like eagles. They will run and not get tired. They will walk and not become weary. What a great word for those who wait upon the Lord. Now, a lot of times when we hear the word wait, we think of just sitting and being still and waiting for God to do His thing. But that's not what we're called to do. The word wait here in this scripture actually is a depiction of one who would wait on tables or serve another person. So the Lord is expecting us to serve Him. So as we serve the Lord, He will renew our strength. And not only that, the scripture says that we will mount up like wings on eagles. Why is it important that God uses eagles here in this description? Well, one of the reasons is that eagles have the unique ability that when a storm comes up, they're able to fly above the storm clouds. So as we wait upon the Lord, as we serve the Lord, we will have renewed strength. And also, when circumstances turn stormy, God will lift us up above those storm clouds. So, Christian, even though much of the nation is under the grip of this core, uh, uh, virus, the COVID-19 virus, just know that God has you in His hands and that His will is going to be done one way or another. So, my prayer is that you will take heed into what the Lord tells us, that you won't worry about what's going on, but that you'll pray about it. And you'll understand that it's in God's hands. We can't change tomorrow by worrying about it. We can't add another day to our life by worrying about it. Uh, as a matter of fact, worry just makes people suffer twice. So, Christian, I would tell you to put your faith in the Lord, continue to serve Him, and be ready to rejoice once this thing is over. But in the meantime, know that when bad times come, and Christian, bad times are going to come, God will lift the faithful up just like an eagle and fly us over the circumstances. I pray that you have a blessed evening. I pray that you have a blessed week. I look forward to sharing some more Bible verses with you in the near future. God bless and have a fantastic evening.